<laughs> it was a slanderous episode with a bunch of cat murder. They they sexually harassed the producer at one point, saying Tiger Woods was. They said Tiger Woods. I forgot you did that. I said Tiger Woods. Ma'am, I'm sorry. I'm I sorry. said Tiger Woods. I'm sorry I brought this monster. I said Tiger Woods. I'll bring this whole company down. Are you ready for this? Let's just fucking do it. Nice. We got Gillis and Soder. A couple of dirt yes. balls are here. What's up, buddy? Just the way it's supposed to be. What's up, buddy? I haven't seen you guys in person, person since 2019. Like, years, years ago. Years. Literally it's years. been years. It's, it's been years. It's years. It was one, it's nice. one of those things that's so obvious, but like someone tweeted the other day that like, I, I, last time I was in school, I was a high school senior, and now I'm going to be a college sophomore. And I was like, just like just seeing it, we're like, wait, holy shit, that's actually fucking weird. It's been Dude, years, man. I'm, losing that awkward freshman year of college must have sucked for a lot of kids. They're going to yeah. be like three years of freshman now. Yeah, you're yeah. going to be you're just, coming in sophomore year with a real I mean, freshman identity. <laughs> yeah. I didn't think of that at all. You, you, kids are all sorts of fucked up now, I bet. <laughs> what do you think, coach? <laughs> I'm chilling. <laughs> This is good. <laughs> last last time we tried to record an episode, just us two. Crap. Really? I, I've never, what I've, I've never had this happen. <laughs> I've never had this happen. What happened? We well, I had it happen, but with other people who like were just not funny, or I was like, like I didn't expect it. I mean, Shane recorded, and it just sucked. Was, was there hangups? Was there weird moments? Just stuff neither of us wanted to talk about. Yeah, it was, about. All, it was also like, about. yeah, there was some you know things we said. Oh, so you guys cut out. And you like, cut the mics and you were like, we shouldn't have done that. Yes. Yeah, and, and, and then it was funny. <laughs> now so, you got to so, release that episode. <laughs> well, no, one, one day, we'll, dude, we'll, we'll, like fucking me an old trucker face Feidelberg over there. <laughs> This guy looks like he's getting lot lizards, by the way. <laughs> he's just getting sucked off in a cab in a triple T station. Dude, you, yeah. Fidelberg gets down. Fidelberg looks like, Fidelberg's mustache makes him look like he has questionable videos on his phone. <laughs> Like yeah, they, yeah. Right, right, they're yeah. the videos that he yeah, they're, fucking makes. They're my videos. But yeah, but yeah, like, no, doing? but I'm saying, like, he's drinking protein <laughs> shakes with his shirt off and just. Yeah, as, as he tells you the word of the day, it is. It's funny. Appalling. I think Dan meant a different kind of video. Yeah, I got I all of them. Oh, I got yeah, all. I meant child I pornography. Meant, but, yeah. No, I know what he meant, but but I, mean, I, I, was like, yeah, I got fucked up ones, and I was also just talking no. about different ones than that. <laughs> yeah. I, I think that you, you know the, the video of porn. Yeah. <laughs> I thought the you were gonna jump in. I'm, no, I'm coming. Yeah. <laughs> I'm coming. I, I you talk to, child porn, I'm in. I thought you were about to bail me out, dude. Are we gonna, this podcast is going to be two black bars over our eyes, and our yeah. voices are going to be like, you mean the sweetest kind of porn? <laughs> yeah. I was, I was uh, yeah. I've been jerking off to... Oh, boy. oh <laughs> man, that is not a transition. You barrel, you yeah. We'll cut that up nice. Uh, <laughs> what have you been jerking off no, to? No, just like, you know, you see one where it's like 18-year-old gets to play, and then you're like, all right, this is weird. <laughs> you get a little older. The barely legal thing starts to get like... Oh, yeah. oh it's a dicey... Know, I know it's, it's, weird I know that it's that it was a hack a... premise, but it's like... It, bear, it, this is almost child porn. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's, and there, that's and the it's kind popular. Of, it's it's yeah. That's like a, that's called. No, I hate it. That's called check the milk porn. <laughs> you know, where you have to like check the date and yeah. you're like, oh, it's still good. <laughs> I can still. Roll with this. You never, you never see like twenty seven year old. You know, it's never like twenty seven yeah. year old gets lady, back blown out. Okay? Lady, lady out of a breakup porn. <laughs> you like, you like mature natural. I love big naturals on milfs, dude. Dude, I had I love a friend. Big. <laughs> I, I, I had a roommate who would jerk off for two hours at a time, oh, and he would what? watch. Yeah, yeah. he'd yeah. come home from work. He'd would he edge? Would he? Was he like sting? Yeah. Was he like tantric? Yeah, yeah, like yeah, like he'd take breaks. Like he'd come out and get like a beer, like full oh, ass. No, <laughs> yeah, be like, dude, yeah. I'm building it up. Like, this that is kid a is a random appalling. roommate. This is a good friend. Yeah, <laughs> he, he, that, that is an appalling and he, and he would behavior. Only, it's absolutely appalling. <laughs> Just seeing the fucking silhouette of your roommate's hard cock. As he gets up, whoa! Yeah. At what point, light out of the fridge? At what point did mid, he explain he was session. doing this? At what point was he like, "Hey, it, dude, just to let you know, I audio you can my fucking <laughs> come." Uh, it took three of no, our second apartment. So we lived together for probably over a year before it's finally, like, bro. What do you do in there for so long when you get home? Yeah, what and he's like, I'm just, I jerk off. But what I'm is like, he literally just like, 
I guess you know, he fucking almost come and he is stopped. It, is it, is no, it no, super no, no, no. slow? Oh, There's just a lot of that. Hold on. <laughs> not yet, not yet, not yet, not yet. Dude, There's... one time he took a shower in the middle of it. And I'm like, I could see him walk across the hallway. <laughs> Did not wear towels or anything. Just hard dick out. So this... Walk across the hallway. Whoa, dude. It's and weird. And jump in the shower. And then just go back to his room hard dick what? still. And he would only watch... Um, Amateur MILF POV blowjobs. That was the that was that that is what a, is specific. A box on it's that as one. incredibly specific amateur MILF as you can POV get. POV blowjob. All right. Does he cut the video? Where he goes, whoa, whoa, whoa! There's a cameraman in there. <laughs> you just, don't look like you actually have kids. You're yeah. not a real MILF. He does boner torture. <laughs> yeah. So he just likes to torture. But when he would come, would it be like a a, a massive release? A, a Tom Segura <laughs> bucket? Ask him? Yeah. I, I honestly, I'd never ask load size. <laughs> I would be. I, that would, that would, I don't know if, if I have to deal that. with his erections in the house, I want to know what are you producing. <laughs> show it to me. <laughs> Bring it out in a cup. You want to show it? Show me why we, you're we, building we, it up that much. <laughs> <laughs> That's got to be a massive it's, nut. It's got. I mean, I can find out for you. <laughs> <laughs> Text him right now. How much did you come back in the day? I feel pal? like it's one of those science fair volcanoes when you put the power in. The, 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 I didn't know you were going to be so crass. <laughs> yes. You brought me in for a Soda sexual in. nature. <laughs> Soda came in hot, Dude, man. Sweatshirt without a hood, what it's very hell? sexual. <laughs> <laughs> Crew neck is for sex talk. Shut up, dude. <laughs> Shut, up, Shut the fuck up, dude. Yeah, dealing with someone else's boner is... The uh, babes are here, dude. Shut yeah. up. <laughs> Shane's playing to the babes in the room. There's Barstool babes, dude. They're yeah. everywhere. Yeah, dude. <laughs> yeah, like I said, dirt balls are here. Uh, <laughs> uh, there's... I don't think I could even jerk off for two hours if I want. If I try, there's nothing more depressing than when you come too quick when you're jerking off. You ever oh, had a, like, oh, I, I've actually mm. I'm convinced now that my style of jerking off has given me premature ejaculation because you go so fast. Now your body's just used to. I just do it like it's ju- like I'm not enjoying it. I haven't yeah. enjoyed jerking off in it's, like it's ten a, years. It's a scientific process. <laughs> <Are> you, <laughs> and it's just like. It's Are you doing, like, quick draw with it's your mustache? It's just, like, medical release. <laughs> like, it's just, like, you're over the toilet. You're, it's, like, gross. <laughs> oh, dude. If we put, like, a thick Wyoming accent on him while he's talking about it's it. It's crazy. Yeah, Free time. So, send him so to jail. So he's getting, like, a different angle on me. He's, like, trying to look it. at me. I gotta pull it out. <laughs> I gotta pull it out before it causes some problems. Sometimes the old lady will be at the store. I just gotta quickly <laughs> pull it out of me. Yeah, how quick are we talking? Like, are you just fucking like... fast, bro. Uh, fucking fast. How fast? Because I'm just watching, like, fucking... Because I don't even have time to go to porn. Oh, no. I'm just looking, like... I'm just, like, looking at Twitter. I'm looking at... Like, you're to Twitter? Twitter? He's like, oh, what Twitter? a fucking good joke. What a good joke. Oh, uh, retweet. Oh. Uh. I'll specifically search out a porn star's Twitter and just, like, uh. scroll her timeline. And just be like, all right, I'll just kind of fire it out real quick, and then I'm just is done. Under a minute? And under a minute for sure, Kevin. Is that, <laughs> is that wait? Is These that hard to nut? Uh huh. Yeah, those are those These are just tiny loads. loads. Those have got to just be. Like, oh bop, yeah, bop, it's bop, just bop. a little like couple. Yeah, little yeah. squirt. Yeah, yeah. 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 just a, a little squirt gun. <laughs> are you? And that's and that's hard to nut. <laughs> yeah, like, instead, like, of, yeah, soup, instead of soup whole, to nuts, it's hard to nut. You get the phone out. You open up Twitter. Are you soft or hard? We're in the like that's you're, like you're where, on the rocks. yeah. Where it's so it's like I didn't you, even want to do this. He just got up on his own and like I just got to figure it out. So by the, and by the time you get your Twitter your Twitter porn star ready, you're fully hard. Yeah. And yeah. by the time you find a tweet, it's over. By the time I'm I'm not, toast. I'm not trying to encourage this, but I'm saying this skill could. You could be a guy that jerks off in public with the way <laughs> you could be a trained. Get a jerker. trench coat, man. Oh, yeah. yeah, I could. Oh, I could be a trained. I, I'd get caught eventually, but I'd be one of those prolific ones. Like he robbed eighty six banks by the time they yeah. caught yeah. me. Yeah, <laughs> like on the D train, you'd be like, I oh, came, and then they would, the doors would shut and you'd be gone. Yeah, they'd make movies about the it. Like, he like we didn't even know. Like we were on we were on his tail for years, <laughs> and we just couldn't catch him. You can do a thing where like you can walk around and then be done coming. <laughs> Gillis, what is happening right now? Uh, <laughs> look, should we leave? Now, just, just like imagine what this episode was without these two. <laughs> That's what it was. I think it's. I think I'm giving full credit to the mustache right now. <laughs> That's what the episode oh, was. Was God. it? Back to your guys' episode. Was it stuff <laughs> that is? It wasn't sexual, obviously. It wasn't tawdry. No, that would have been odd. If it was just me and him in this room. Just be just like, like God, with it. how do you God. come? <laughs> <laughs> Real quiet. What do you always look like? Yeah. Oh, I love to kiss. I like kissing, dude. 
Yeah. Oh, look, you touching knees now. <laughs> now we're just going, we're fucking breaking barriers. You know I like kissing, dude. You brought yeah, it up. My favorite thing is... <laughs> I told you not to tell anybody yeah, that, man. S- stop talking about soft lips. <laughs> <laughs> for kissing in porn. All of it, dude. <laughs> no. You like kissing in porn? <laughs> No, I hate kissing. Kissing is the weirdest. It's the worst. Yeah, you know, no, when, no, when, better. It's like I've, I've come around on kissing the porn. I'm like, oh yeah, what? kiss are good. What? That, that like ASMR <laughs> type shit. Where it's oh, the yeah, tongue it's so flick. Gay. It's the tongue you flick. Watch you like watching the, another the guy spit kiss? Slopping, <laughs> the sloppy shit. There's like a, <laughs> I, don't know, I don't know where I'm trying to go with this. I'm trying to make a joke. I don't know. I don't have it. I'm like I'm like I was all just... in here. I'm like I don't know. Like yeah, well, they, they zoom in real close on our tongue. It was just gonna get weirder. Be happy. I pulled the shoot when I did. But porn <laughs> porn kissing is not real kissing. Porn kissing is always like. The tongue flicking. Yeah, and the, it's the, like the little wiggling back and forth. <laughs> yeah. 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 It's just pussy eating in a mouth. They should do old, uh-huh. they should do old married kisses where they're like, okay, bye. <laughs> <laughs> you know how rich people kiss yeah. and they barely touch lips? They go, how about okay, when- you ready to fuck my ass? <laughs> <laughs> Get in I'm gonna there. Fucking come. I'm going to fucking come. I'm going to fucking bust. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah, it's got to be a category. What, rich people kissing? Old people people kissing. kissing over and over again. Yes, dude, one hundred percent. Wait, are you saying old people or rich? People? Anybody? Let's go. Let's, let's, let's give it a whirl. Yeah. Kiss porn. Kiss, dude, kiss porn. Kiss We're gonna have Heidelberg thing. popping in thirty seconds. <laughs> yeah, that's let's that's just, true. Don't I'm just gonna search search kiss. Porn yeah, up. dude, we get them all riled up. <laughs> worst, you know what the worst is when you open Pornhub in front of your boys. <laughs> and they see your recommendeds. Oh, oh yeah. You don't want your boys to see your fucking recommendeds. I don't want to see my recommendeds. I go, why are you into, why are you into kilt stuff? <laughs> Dude, all right. I'll tell you this. This is a... I got... So, look. I like young babes. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, and I somehow the algorithm decided that I liked a genre of porn that was just like hot studs. <laughs> oh. so, I don't know. There's a category of like a hot guy. Hot guys, fuck. Yes. Oh, 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 we know. I've been recommended big cock. Yeah, before. I don't like this. For sure. Yo, what are you doing? Why are you guys mixing my recipe up? <laughs> just, I know like, queer. I know damn queer. Did you ever see Julio with his massive penis? And you go, what are you trying to tell me? You talking to Google? <laughs> what Google say? What, what Google say? say? Google say I was gay because I asked if the sweatshirt was gay. <laughs> Is Google telling you I might be gay. Fuck you guys. Stop talking. Is it Twitter? Is it liking gay stuff? Yeah, Alexa. <laughs> yeah dude. Uh, if it sees stud in the recommended, and you're, hey Google, play Wham. <laughs> <laughs> you get on porn of it's like yo, you're yeah. gay. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, Jesus I, I would feel offended <laughs> on it. It's a... good to have people back in here. Yeah, you know? yeah. <laughs> this would never happen over Zoom. <laughs> Imagine if you're just sitting in your own apartment talking about this while we do it over the computer. I don't think that works. I've always thought about like what my neighbor through pandemic has heard. Oh, yeah. There's a specific oh, yeah. room you do podcasts in, and the neighbors like it might just be a little kids' room. I think next to me. <laughs> oh, no. And it's all I'm like, all right, bring that video up of her asshole. <laughs> show, show, all right, Jay, slow it down on the bonfire. That's how the Exorcist started. What the girl was like, this is my friend. He talks to me. Oh yeah, yeah. Was just right. Some kid that was like, <laughs> I'm, there's a demon through the wall. She's like, getting, she's oh, yeah, you like <laughs> that? Oh, 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 well, I started watching wrestling when I was a kid. She's in there responding. She, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> they got her tied up to the bed. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, anyways, uh, so check out my special. Uh. <laughs> I did think about that for a while. Like I, th- I, I didn't think about it too much when I was still in New York. And then when I went home for a bit. And I would just do podcasts where I was whispering because, uh, like, your my mom, mom comes was downstairs and... having a cup of tea. And I was like, "Yeah, we just like I don't know. I kind of I like when they kiss a lot more." Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And then you come upstairs, and, she and then, then she takes out his big hard is, cock. Is, is the kissing my fault? Do you like it because I kissed you on the lips until you were fifteen? No, I probably because like she didn't kiss. Oh no, mom. yeah, no, mom, shut up, she shut made, up. She made you right, so what's my search bar says? Mommy kisses. <laughs> So what? That's what they're recommending me. Sounds pretty good. Yeah. Mommy kisses? <laughs> Dude, if, you can watch, if I can watch a video of just a, a guy with salt and pepper hair going, hey, good job. Yeah, just, like dad, yeah, come everywhere. Dad reassurement Pat porn. on the back. Hey, you've done a really good job and you worked real hard. Take it easy on yourself. And you're like, I'm going to fucking lose it. I'm gonna fucking- oh, I got emotional. This uh, I did Tampa. Yeah. Flew down there. Got him. I cried on the plane watching Moneyball. Yeah, oh, yeah. watching Dude, Moneyball. Moneyball got me. I don't when? know what happened. It'll get I was you. on the plane. I was no, just like, no, no, no. When in the movie? <laughs> <laughs> when I started winning, I was doing like the, the hold your breath yeah. whippers. Yeah. Like, well, when yeah, the, that, that, when that, the A's that, got that, swept yeah. in the first round. Yeah, yeah. yeah dude, I, I call that the no. tea kettle where you're like, 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. No, it was during the streak, dude. When yeah. they hit, yeah. the line, I was just like, <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to think what I got. Fucking Hatterboro hits a home run. I was just like, <gasps> <gasps> we got at Jimmy oh. Fallon. He went, he was at Jimmy Fallon when Jimmy Fallon came out. He, he wasn't on. What? He wasn't on the show. He was in the audience. Yeah, yeah, Wait, you're telling me he was that big of a Jimmy Fallon fan? <laughs> yeah, uh, he he he's he's a notorious crier. He oh, cries at everything. Weird. But <laughs> but I was like, okay, I get it. You cry at like sports moments. You you have a big family. You all cry. All this shit. But crying at Jimmy Fallon is the most pathetic thing I've ever heard. That it's is... money balls are close. That game. Money, no, listen, Jimmy Ball was good, dude. No, dude, crying Maybe, in a plane. Is, crying in a plane is a thing. Rich Voss has a whole theory about <laughs> crying on a plane. He looked it up and he said scientists say that you you're you're more likely to cry or get emotional in the air in a plane for some reason. <laughs> that makes sense. Which I've been ripped open by multiple movies, including the Mr. Rogers documentary <laughs> and A Place Beyond the Pines made me openly cry on an overnight flight. I openly Dude, cried I in my hands. I to fucking the Beauty and the Beast uh, live reaction. Like, why wouldn't you? Why wouldn't you? It's a beautiful story. <laughs> when, when, when he turns, when, when, uh, oh, the greatest showman? When he showman, raping her, I, I definitely her. cried to that. The greatest showman. I cried to the greatest showman on a plane. What about I, Barnum and Bailey? Not only did I cry on that flight, as soon as it <laughs> ended, as soon as we were going to LA, <laughs> we started it. He goes, this guy, this guy, guy really. I, I watched it right again. Really? You ran it back? I ran it right You're back. Like, I got to watch that guy torture tigers again. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I got to watch him rip the teeth out of old black women and say that they're. What? That was something he actually did. Yeah. Is he George yeah. Washington? He, he, like, yeah. he, like, he, he ripped the teeth out of the, like, this old black woman who they said was like the oldest woman alive. And it was just some woman he's, whose teeth he'd ripped out. Ah, yeah. Dude, what a, a thing! To, what anyway, a weird thing Jack to pitch. The Jackson version is a lot more fun, dude. No <laughs> one talks about how wild circuses must have been in like the twenties. Oh, that you. That was a that was a thing. People yeah. and making them. Yeah, you're like, why not? Like, look at you want to watch me pull this lady's teeth out? Yeah. She's the oldest woman say, in the world. The better <laughs> the better attraction is not come see the oldest woman in the world. It's come see me rip the teeth out of this woman's head. It was, and then Carney's just got a bad rap. It's like, yeah, yeah I've been tortured, tortured for forty years. I dried meth. What I'm, do you want I'm me to sorry, do? I have a beard, but I've been <laughs> locked away in captivity for. Jesus but, Christ. But specifically in the 20s when they could just go with wherever they wanted, they were like, hey, I'm uh, just starting to think about doing this traveling show. And it's a bunch of elephants that we kick the shit out of. And then it's a bunch of weird people. I'd like to see the footage of those guys just teeing off on those elephants. <laughs> <laughs> like a stick. Yeah. Just like, Ta! They, they're up there, dude. Figure out how to dance. Yeah. Fucking hit it. Paw! Figure it out. Paw! Yeah, hit him yeah. until something happens. Yeah. Also, like, yeah. trying out what works for abuse. You know, this pool cue does nothing. <laughs> And then one of those things going wild in an old town. It's just like, they're up there. Oh, God. Oh, no. Trample that's, how, yeah. that's how traveling shows started. They just yeah. tore a tour and down. Everyone's dead. Down. You guys are also talking about my recommended sidebar on YouTube. <laughs> Elephant Stomps Trainer. It's my favorite. <laughs> they're the best. Dude, no, here's the best one. For real. Indians and then Jaguars get lost in their towns. <laughs> And then the whole town comes out. So there's thousands of people, and a jaguar just pops out. And they all just <laughs> pawn them. They what like and run. <laughs> it's so ah, funny. shit. And Dude. Then it hides in someone's house. Are it's you crazy. telling me if I, I can just uh, YouTube? Yes. And then there's Indian one. There's, jaguars. there's two. There's two great ones. There's a jaguar that pops out of a roof. <laughs> it's so funny. And then there's one where it's just out of pool. And Indian it's just tagging attack. dudes. <laughs> it's just trying to run. And here's the roof. Really? Tackle oh, I've seen this roof one. This roof one's roof's unbelievable. Watch the roof one because the Does first it? guy swings a stick at it. And it's the best thing in the world. <laughs> the lowest effort you've ever seen. They're not paying yeah, attention. look at that. There's guys looking away. <laughs> oh. <laughs> look at this. I mean, it's a whole town effort. Almost, it really takes chaos, a village dude. to kill a jaguar. <laughs> Dude, chaos, <laughs> jaguars are too agile. Yeah, I mean, you can't fucking... A jaguar is going to win 100 times out of 100. <laughs> Hold that door. By the way, absolutely... I can understand anyone yelling weird in that video oh. because there's no way I would be cool around a jaguar on a roof. I'd be like, oh, fuck, oh, fuck. Oh, fuck, guys. Fuck a jaguar. Fuck a jaguar. There's a guy sitting next to the hole that it pops out of. Looking the other way, when it pops out, he's like, oh, shit. <laughs> he just <laughs> swings a stick, not even close to it. And he does a bat flip, dude. He, like, swings it. <laughs> God, I thank great. God you don't live in a place like that, huh? Well, <laughs> yeah. Dude, being surprised by nature, just walking Can up. Can nature be an issue? Oh, that's another one of my favorites. With the, the monkey hiding in, uh, I don't know where this one is, but the monkey's hiding in an alleyway. Who just... He just runs out and jumps on anyone and then hides back in oh, the yeah, alleyway. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And it's like, this town's like, people are just kind of like, 
slowly trying to figure out if the monkey's going to be there that day. Do you just go like, with like two coffees for work and you're like... You goddamn dirty ape! <laughs> yeah, dude, I, I, man, I think I, I've put a lot of thought into it, and I think eighty percent of animals could fuck me up if they were mad at me. Eighty? Oh, I think that's a low number. This is a question we've done. But like, what's the? How do we word it? What's like the fiercest. biggest, the fiercest animal you think you could take? Shit. Like a, like an angry raccoon? You think you could beat up a raccoon? S- uh, yeah. Yes. Oh, yeah, I do. Here's, on a raccoon. But here's the thing about raccoons: you're not with dude, your bare paws. If they yes. come, dude, yes. if they yes. come you at you, you squeeze it. To you'd death. have to get it. But here's the thing: you'd have to be cool with getting bit and yeah. scratched you're a bunch. Get bit your and hands are gonna get ripped of up, course. and you're, and you're con- confident you're not gonna be like, ah, get away. Uh, well, like I mean, I'll definitely do that. But is this a fight to the death, or is this yeah, just a few times? I'm not gonna kill a raccoon if I run into one. Right, right. I mean, like it's a fight. That would be a weird vow to make in your life. I'm not like, see a raccoon and be like, there's that motherfucker. Yeah. <laughs> I'm just, we're just with Shane going on a hike, and he's like, hey, guys, <laughs> hold this real quick. Told you, motherfucker. He's pulling out of the bush. Holy shit. Shane just killed that raccoon. He's like, Dude, there was a family of them at this radio station I worked at in in Tucson. No, they're not. I love them. I, I I would only get a parking spot. When I come in for my shift, it'd be like 6 p.m. <laughs> right by the dumpster where they would all congregate at night. Great. Yeah, the dumpster dumps. And then at, at night, it was Arizona, so you'd want to leave your windows down because it was so oh, hot. No, no. So yeah. I'd be high as <laughs> shit. so scary. Dude, I'd always get in my car. Wait, 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 like, wait. You're telling me you would park <laughs> next to a family of raccoons and leave yeah. your windows down? I'd be a crap. I mean, that's just you reckless. Were you just, you're concocting the worst possible recipe yeah. to end the work day. I would, crack, I would crack the window, right? And I never learned my lesson. <laughs> Because then they would be like, <laughs> they would all be eating there with their little fucking human hands. They're the best. And they're all like, <laughs> and then they'd be under my car so sometimes. Somebody being afraid of them in your car. Like, <laughs> oh, no. No. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. I would come out, right? I would come out in the parking lot at 3 a.m. at the end of my shift, and I'd smoke a cigarette at the door to hype myself up. Like, here oh, we go. Fucking, Let's go, go was, time. I'd stomp it out, and I'd be like, <laughs> and then in one movement, I'd try to open the door, get, like, get... Turn it on and like yeah. look around. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> but they were all, sometimes they'd be under my car, but they never got my feet. Yeah. <laughs> but I was always worried. Yeah. Have you seen the video of the uh, the raccoon whisperer? Yeah. No, but the guy up feed in, him hot in, in, in uh, <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah. rules. Oh, with all of them, like yeah. forty yeah. every night, and he just throws tons of hot dogs and grapes and shit, and they're like little uh, human. We always used to send each other the one where the guy gets bit. Oh, yeah. Where he goes, "Hey, come here," because <laughs> the thing is, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Dude, they're fucking vicious. But I, you know, I think I could take it if I had to go full on survival course, mode. Dude. I would just fucking well, okay, grab so that what, head. What, 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 yes. How high do you bonk go? it? What? I think I just have to bonk it a bunch. <laughs> yeah, I feel like you grab that tail. Yeah, that's what it is, dude. That tail off, yeah. you oh, it around. but then if it yeah. slid out, yeah. I yeah. absolutely be like, <laughs> <laughs> like if it got out of my grasp, yeah, like, like, like when you uh, just hand your hands, yeah. Yeah. Just, yeah. Dude, seaweed you outside could, of the you water. You would crush a raccoon. Yeah, you would crush. You could, dude, coyote. 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 You would coyote. crush. You would no, crush. You would crush. Coyote crazy. will fuck you up. It will fuck you up. You're gonna get no, fucked no, no, up by not, all I, these animals. But I would have to do a forearm. I'd have to have him get my forearm. I think you have to control him like that. You got to get it down its throat. You what? can't even just get it like you, you, you gotta get your whole hand down. <laughs> yeah. 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 Finish here. You gotta like rip it like stomach spine. out. No, yeah. these are animals. You guys are naming small animals. You can definitely. How big is a coyote? I think I, I think of a coyote. I that's think like, like, a, like a like a, almost like a size of a wolf. It's like a no, it's small not. dog. Oh, my dog is the, my dog's forty pounds. I'd say a coyote's about forty pounds. Come they on, they can get big, but yeah. Aren't Could you take a wolf? Like fierce as wolf. Wolf's tough. Come on, bro! You cannot take a wolf. I Chain's a big guy. No, there is no, no fucking I, I can't. shot. You could take a wolf. I mean, I can't. you're fucking. Do I get a weapon? On with coyotes, you could. I mean, cross coyotes, coyote. adult coyotes, are fifteen to forty six pounds. Bring it. Yep. And if you give me a they're fucking like Lu- Louisville, though, it's no, not, they're not. It's not about the size. It's about the <laughs> no. They're yeah, they, they, the they don't they're stop coming forward. Yeah. He's right. They do. They're scab. They're shitty. There's okay. coyotes. All right, but a wolf brother. My house, dude. My cat stands up to him. Yeah? Yeah. The Yotes, the Coyotes. Tibbled. Tibbled. Tibbled the cat. The Prince of Cats. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is funny. My uh, my family's got to get rid of them. Why? Well, because my sister's moving back in with her okay. two dogs. Oh, my, wow. my family's house Poor is, a, t- wait, is so, crazy. So Tibble just wait, is Tibble's Katie so or like, Sarah's? Tibble was mine. It's it's yours? Wait a minute. Yeah, I just whoa, whoa, couldn't whoa, bring him to the city. He's an outdoor cat. Tibble the cat just gets the boot because these new kids on the block? They found a nice place for him for a month. 
So he's going to my cousin Frankie's house, who, has, 30 days who has 11 cats. Oh, oh. No, 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 no. Dude, I'm not letting Tibble go into the system. <laughs> yeah. Tibble's, yeah. In the system. <laughs> Tibble's not going Foster into the system. Care, man. If you're watching this right now, you find Tibble adopt, the new home. I swear to God, <laughs> adopt, adopt no, Tibble. I love Tibble. We're keeping him. He's you're not back. keeping him. You're giving him to the he's fucking going to 11, care. He's going to come back different, dude. Yeah, my man. cousin. Yeah, he's going to come back wilder. <laughs> he's nuts. I like it. But listen, my cousin brought these 11 cats... Yeah, right. he's he eleven he cats. He's Give me like a little bit of color. Your cousin first. He's okay. nuts. So he wore a Purdue windbreaker to my cousin his brother's wedding. <laughs> yes, this guy's an animal. All right, I get it. Guy, yeah. guy lives and always dies has, with Drew Brees. Always has a jug of iced tea. Always has a jug for a spitter. Always has a gym bag because he lifts constantly. Animal and eleven cats. Animal drove to every note for a while. He was driving. He has, he goes to every note game. But I thought From he would rock. He would drive. But, down he, but, I, but he rocks a Purdue. He loves Dayton. He loves <laughs> Purdue. Just the, he just like, loves you know, college those, gears. Those, just, he loves just, Bishop just, Gorman t-shirts now because he went to Vegas twice. <laughs> He's out of his mind. Dude. Oh, wow, the funniest guy. guy on earth. This, this guy, guy, yeah, for real. <laughs> and he drove those eleven cats. They were at his wife's mom's house or something. He drove. He rented a truck and drove them to Pennsylvania from Sacramento, <laughs> California to fucking Pennsylvania with eleven cats. Truck full of cats. <laughs> just you just fucking going. Th- and he oh, rented like, the they, truck. Were they, were they, and what, what the fuck did Enterprise say when he brought it back? I don't know, like, dude. Have go, you had like hey, double digit yeah, cats in here for days? Hey, the, the only way I can describe this smell is over five cats. <laughs> yeah. Was this over five cats, or did you just pour a bunch of bleach in the back seat, <laughs> man? I wish you'd know him. He'd respond. He'd be like, "Yeah, what? Yeah, so what?" I got some fucking 70. cats. I got some cats, Shaner. He, he picked That's up Shaner. Where, 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 some cats. Where were the cats in Sacramento? I don't know. I guess they were at like his... He just picked them up somewhere? Like, also, I did you... Somehow cats there was 11 was cats. Was it like that old shit. Carmelo Anthony New York Knicks trade where like he got all 11 cats in one deal? <laughs> yeah. They just shipped all yeah, the cats? Yeah, I mean. Like, did, did he acquire them here and there or was it just 11 in one shot? I think it was 11 in one shot. That's so <laughs> many to go, cats. To go from zero cats in your life to a Dude, they have a room. Insanity. They have it's a room one thing if house. you just slowly accumulate. They have a room in their house. I'm with sure. Like Twelve <laughs> kitty litter boxes. <laughs> just, uh, a dozen cats. Clips the cat's deplorable. nails. Deplorable. What? <laughs> The hell? Did he grab them and they're just cool? The most <laughs> despicable <laughs> thing I've no, ever heard. The man is the man. Dude. dude, you have to be comfortable with just sitting there at all times of the day hearing. Dude, <laughs> he used to challenge me and my friends to play tackle football when he was like 40. <laughs> He'd be like, tell you what, come down, bring your pussy friend. <laughs> He goes, cats want to watch. I got a whole cheerleading squad of cats. He shows up there all stacked in cheerleading guard. outfits. Dude, he takes off his shirt and he's just he scratched. Play nose, dude. dude, taking off his shirt and he's just got scars all over him. Like, <laughs> like, a, like fucking Rambo in First Blood. Yeah. He tried to do pat like pass blocking drills with me. What? Yeah. It's Uncle Rico. He wanted to yeah. play D. He wanted to be a nose guard. This sounds like a person from one of your skits. <laughs> this, this sounds like, like a dude. What would be Keen's great person. is if he just came out of his house with like old eighties football pads, like a neck roll and a bar yeah. down the middle, and he's yeah. like, "Stop me! I'm gonna play. Th- <laughs> the, I'm gonna play the, the five position. The, the Brian Cox fucking uh, yeah, the flat yeah, back. Yeah. Just a, a breathe right strip over it. He's like, you ready to get you ready to get serious about this, Shiner? <laughs> You want to bring your, Dude, the, Shane, you want to bring your pussy friend? Bring it, you and your little pussy friend. Hold on, guys. The there's something going on in the cat room. <laughs> <laughs> I think there's a fight for one of the towers. <laughs> there's this constant cat rumbles. <laughs> guys, they're so loud at night. Oh, like when they all run night. at night. <laughs> Dude, how can you sleep at night? with <laughs> absolute chaos. How it's can bad. you sleep what at night they, with like, the smell rebel? of ammonia? You think they ever just have like a revolution? Like we're Dude, just I, taking the whole house. We're getting st- rid of the human. Stomp them out. <laughs> Here, let me see. Yeah, he's got rules. Yeah. 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 That guy's fucking awesome. He is eating a ham, a ham salad sandwich. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That is amazing. That, like, that, like, <laughs> Uncle Rick is just like, didn't you? Weren't you a big Notre Dame fan? Like, yeah, they were sold out. I just went anywhere in Indiana. Purdue. That worked. <laughs> Close goes, enough. Purdue's pretty sweet. Drew, Bre- <laughs> Drew Brees played there, so I'm pretty Neil pumped Armstrong about it. Went, don't know if you knew that. He knows more about college football than it. I mean, I, he might uh, be autistic now that I'm <laughs> <laughs> definitely piecing this together. 11 cats is a <laughs> pretty autistic. <laughs> that is a thing to start All right, guessing. how about that? How many cats could take could you, you down? Could you kill? Or 20. how many cats for you to get killed? Are they all mad at me? They're all really mad They're at me. Yeah. yeah. Again, yeah, it's, it's a revolution. A it's, it's a cat that, you know, a revolution of cats. There's a cat leader who is organizing them, and they have a thirst for human blood. Can I? Ooh, that'd be a terrible way to go, because yeah. they would hurt, because they, they, they can't do death. anything. Yeah, yeah. they just, yeah. it'd be, you have to bleed out. Yeah. Ugh. 
Do I get what I'm wearing right now? Long sleeve? Sure. I will uh, cover 50. your arms. 50? 50? 50. 50. Fucking. Yeah. Dude, you guys are more I'm going confident full than, than I thought you'd House be. cats? I'm going full yeah. let me. I'll put a hurt on that. Yeah, yeah. dude. I'm going I'm to pop and twist a lot of them. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you guys don't want to hear this, but the way I'm going to get through it is just like a fucking opening mail that I haven't gotten in a fucking <laughs> month where I'm like, and now, all right. And now, all right. <laughs> it's like scratch-offs. Yeah, exactly. You're just sitting at the bar. Just <laughs> <laughs> I fill it up. Oh, man. Then, yeah. You don't think, think you don't think there'd be a little bit of like emotional fatigue when you're when you've killed like your 13th <laughs> Cat, you're like, oh my god! You can't even see your hands anymore because they're just dripping in cap. One (laughs) through five, I care about, and the rest. And forty-five through fifty, I start sobbing openly. (laughs) Where I'm like, why did you make me do this KFC? (laughs) (laughs) Why did you make me? All right, this is another question. Fifty, I I just do this. (laughs) (laughs) Your iPod? (laughs) (laughs) Every time you hear a cat purr for the rest of your life. Yeah, do you guys jerk off to Garfield and Friends? <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm fucking sorry. I'm sorry. You know, I fucking hate Mondays, don't you, you fat little slut? <laughs> you fu- little you slut. fat little lasagna eating <laughs> slut. Where's Jim? Where'd Jim go? <laughs> He's beating off because I killed some of the cats. They were talking about... Uh... <laughs> oh, There's that cough yeah. of that mustache. Uh, I'm, I'm laughing Please so hard. Up. Uh, what are you drinking there, a fucking cup of milk? Yeah, dude. <laughs> what is that? The Nate Bargatze special. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Is dude. there any coffee in there? I'm telling you right now. It's my life. It, yeah, I love it. Do I, I don't look like a psycho to Milk you, with ass. <laughs> uh, I, don't, I go into Dunkin' and they, when I ask for cream, they always put a disrespectful <laughs> amount of crazy. cream in it. It's crazy. They're like, what I are you going to say? say? Light, please, Yeah. Then Then they look like they're mad at you. They're like... You ruined my day, man. I wanted to load you up Sorry. on cream. I wanted to really dump all the this airport, half and half. In. The airport in Tampa, they, I got a nice coffee. The lady, I was like, I got a splash of milk. She filled it up before she put any coffee in that much milk. That's a lot I was of milk. like, is this good? That's a cereal <laughs> amount of like, milk. It's absolutely not I was like, good. Yeah, yeah. Not, yeah. <laughs> yeah, of course, of course, right? But you know, yeah, perfect. Love it. I'm she gonna, held I'm gonna it love up. this coffee. If she, like, if good she milk, had fucking like, no. showed you that amount of milk and then spit in it, would you have said something then? <laughs> like, I'd go, what yeah. you, I'd be like, what are you doing later? <laughs> yeah. What are you, what are you, you doing? Trying to fuck me? What? That's a Tampa hello. Yeah, Todd Splitters. Put ice in it. You gonna be a Todd Splitters lighter? <laughs> yeah, dude. I don't know. They do it, and I just like, yeah, whatever. I like my milk drink. Ben- <laughs> didn't uh, didn't Bennington have a bit for a while? I think he did. In fact, I'm sure he did. He had a thing where he, people would call in and like, you know how was it Dan Patrick where they would say like their weight or whatever? Yeah, yeah, yeah. These guys would call in and name their number of sixth graders they could kill. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh yeah, that was a Ron and Fez bit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah, yeah. How many yeah. sixth graders do you think? Yeah. Six sixth graders. Yeah, yeah. Well, uh, I think the, the question like, like, are, okay, we, so we, we give you a baseball bat and I no. think a helmet. <laughs> And how many uh, how many fifth graders could you take? Whoa! <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Honestly, when I gas uh, yeah. out, exactly. That's yeah. yeah, like it's just it's, it's a just, buffet it's, amount. I eat till I, <laughs> I eat till I throw up. It's like going plate. to the batting cages when you're like 20, 20 in. Yeah. Oh my god, this is a lot harder than I thought. Now oh, here's and my then they overrun you. Here's my question: Which <laughs> retired professional athlete could you beat up? And they they can't be older than sixty. While they're in a dead, you get you get to start from them in a dead sleep. So like a Vander Holyfield's dead asleep. (laughs) Bare hands. Bro, I'll give you, you a small I weapon. I can't believe you went with Evander Holyfield. <laughs> uh, the short of me having a gun. But I'm saying that's the range I'm looking for. Retired. Let me okay. let me specify this. Venus Re- Williams. <laughs> you you think you could? Whale on Venus. I don't yeah, think you would, dude. I'm gonna call your bluff on that one, sir. Yeah. You don't think I could beat that? Dude, I'll tell you. That was worse than Evander Holyfield. If you if you Venus Williams would slide out and then it's all. Yeah, and then I'll whale on. No, dude, she gets through tennis. You're gonna catch Venus Williams? No way. Once she's up, fight. I'm not saying she couldn't beat me in a race. You're also starting with her to dead. Sleep. And then it's over, dude. I don't know. I'm getting, what's, your first I move? what's your, what's your first move? You're getting out. <laughs> you're grounded it's and over. pounded. You're giving the old UFC. He's not getting out. You know when yeah. they like the hammer, the hammer, yeah, the hammer throw. Yeah. Yeah. Dude, I said Venus. I, I was if you don't like Jeff Garcia. I think. I, 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 don't know. I bet <laughs> Jeff Garcia runs your ass into the ground. Yeah, 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 I bet yeah, he'd be like, I was sleeping. I was sleeping. And then he's just fucking your shit up. And I'm a Niners fan. I was sleeping. sleep. This mustachio man came in here. Oh fuck. Fuck Venus Williams up. No, dude, you guys are out of your, <laughs> your <laughs> shit. The only person I can think of is you... like David Eckstein. That's it. You guys are crazy. Dude, I don't know, man. I would you even say David Eckstein's like five foot six. I was gonna ass, name uh, jockeys. Yeah, uh, I was gonna name like yeah. whoever yeah, jockeys. You gotta take the horse too. Oh, dude, that's crazy. <laughs> that junkie. They go fully assemble, and then they jump on the horse, and you're like, fuck, fuck. He got to his machine. <laughs> you guys are 
being pussies about Venus Williams. <laughs> what's, her, right. what's, her, what's her weight and shit? Jeff Garcia would wail on Venus yeah. Williams. Dude, Jeff Garcia, yeah. I, I think I actually, I thought he kind of just disappeared. Now that I'm thinking about it, he is like back in the in the media now. I think he's, really, isn't he coaching or is he in the media? I think he's Why in the media. Why does that matter? He used to be a but, fucking but like, professional but, football player, man. No, because he's, he's, like, beat you he's up. like in shape still. Yeah, yeah, he's in yeah. good like, shape. There, there are plenty of quarterbacks who just got fat and they're a fucking mess yeah. over there. I yeah. think Jeff Garcia is still, still hitting the weights and things like that. I don't think any former NFL no players. No way. I don't I'd have to get one like, with ALS. Quarterbacks, yeah. quarterbacks. Like, I think I could take Matt Stafford today. No, no way. Yeah. 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 Talking Kick about the shit out he of you. He would fucking How smoke big is Stafford? you. How Dude, big he's like is six five. You would, you would, you would, yeah, that's one of like the last guys yeah. I was picking. Yeah. He's been living in Detroit. I think Steve Nash like, is probably like, a little bitch. Yeah, yeah. He's a good Steve bitch. Nash knows. I bet he's crafty. I bet Steve Nash would go into like a Lotus style. Yeah, six three two thirty. I can't play with. There's a lot of there's a lot of soccer players. There's a lot of soccer players. Would no. kick Mia Ham, I'll fuck her up, yeah. dude. I'll tell you this: Mia Ham's probably still got the gas tank. If you dude, if you can't put her down, this is gonna be a long fight. I'm laying on them <laughs> at night and punching them. <laughs> yeah. and she's like, just she right wakes up. Like, yes, Megan Mia, Rapinoe. Mia, bow, 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 I would never do that to an LGBTQ legend. <laughs> but I dare you. Anyone outside of <laughs> NF? Oh, man, see, what? no, I'm treating her equally. What sport? That, that's, that's what's true? You're equality. saying soccer? I will fight you at night, right, Megan Rapinoe. <laughs> yeah. You're saying soccer would be the sport you would pick to fight all the former athletes? Yeah, there's no. Oh, other if area. you had to put a sport to it, golf maybe. Golf, perhaps. Golf. Golf. Golf's the way to go. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, dude, let me get a shot at John Daly when he's asleep. <laughs> no. I love him. You're picking another. I would never. I, I don't want an easy walk. I don't want a fucking you tomato can. It. You yeah. want to earn it. I could take VJ Singh. Who's that? Sure. <laughs> Who's that but kid? I want fucking. Can I take Tiger? Can we fight tonight, though? Tiger would <laughs> fuck like, like, All not, four of not us a, Not if he yeah. doesn't get the no. heel first. He's got two broken if he legs. Found out right. he got to do, if he found out he got to do dirty shit with her, <laughs> he would fucking walk through all four of us. Whoa, dude. Don't harass one of the babes. Don't harass the Marshall babes. I'm not, dude. I'm saying if Tiger Woods was like, is she? I'm not. He'd go, is she my trophy? <laughs> and we'd be like, yeah, and he'd be like, ah. and pills and fucking go at it. <laughs> Just ah. one by one by one. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Tiger would wail on He'd us. fuck us up. <laughs> it always made me laugh because when I was, I used to smoke pot. And me and my friends, <laughs> I remember watching like a Ravens game once and just imagining how scary it'd be if Ray Lewis just uh, kicked in the door. Just the, yeah. just the instant panic of a like, dude breaking in the door and all of us like, do we, <laughs> do we bring up, do we, re, do we bring up the joke that we always used to do in the car on the road Which about, one? About breaking into someone's house. It's a sad sports story. Give it. Oh, God, oh, dude. God. This is like my favorite thing. <laughs> yeah. so I, I already know who it's about. It's Sean it's, Taylor. It's fucked oh, up. Because oh, 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 the story is. I think Dan he said it's there, funny. So. I don't think. <laughs> what the fuck? I didn't think it's funny. The bit we do. Oh, listen. So Sean Taylor's house, he got killed while someone was breaking, breaking into his house. house yeah. But he. He had a machete. He had a machete and he was naked. Lights mm. out. Lights out, attack them with a machete. So Shane and I always used to do the guys breaking into the house. Yeah. We were like, look at this fucking place. Check out these jerseys. <laughs> and you're like, it's Sean Taylor. And then you hear it from down the hey! hall. He's like, who the fuck's in my <laughs> house? Like, hey! And oh, he's like, ah, ah, ah. like, fuck, 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 He's in a closet behind you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, just one, just one of the guys getting stuck by Sean Taylor. <laughs> <laughs> oh, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> go to sleep. Go to sleep. Yeah. Oh fuck! Did, oh, he, did fuck. he get any of them before, the, before they got him? I think, I think, I think, I think they shot him in the yeah. leg. Yeah, and then yeah, they right. killed. They like shot yeah, him. They hit him like the femoral artery. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I think it's yeah. Like, where everyone learned about the femoral yeah. artery. Yeah. That's yeah. exactly how I learned. From, and that's how I learned. I learned. You always learn shit through sad stuff. That's how I learned about that artery. And uh, heavy D is how I learned about deep vein thrombosis, <laughs> which is a blood clot from flying, because that's what he got. It went to his brain. So now I'm now I'm all paranoid. Oh fuck! That's why you're flying on the plane, man. I bummed you out. You're right? sitting there yeah. watching, watching movies thinking I might be dead. Dude, I'm deep like, phone thrombosis. Deep, deep vein <laughs> thrombosis. I don't like that. DVB. How do you or think no, you're going to go? Oh, if a heart attack. Yeah. Yeah? yeah. yeah. No doubt. No doubt. <laughs> no doubt. How do you think you're going? No doubt. I'm 100% going to cancer. Yeah? Yeah. I, would, I don't think I'd last I would, to cancer. I think well, I'd, uh, I'd beat cancer. <laughs> I'm just, I'll get you the punch. I'm just out first. Yeah, yeah before we know how you're going. <laughs> There's a good chance I really sink its teeth into me. Final I think I'm gonna going to get with, with one of the weapons from Clue. One way, <laughs> yeah. somehow, some way. I think I'm going to get winged. <laughs> I'm going to get winged by cancer or a heart attack. You know, yeah, yeah. and then I'm just going to be a shell of myself. And yeah. then just eventually, it'll be like one of those things where uh, I be die. You're going to be an old man sitting there, and then people are going to be like, "Hey, Dan, you're back." I do voices. <laughs> <laughs> they go, I don't know who Ronnie Dangerfield is. They go, oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I respect. 
<laughs> no, and everyone's gonna be like, oh, uh, and my it. hands are just permanently like this, and they're like, Dan. <laughs> yeah, I think that like yeah. probably like around sixty, and then <laughs> just, and then just one day the lights will be out, and everyone will feel a little relieved that yeah, they no exactly. longer have to take care of me. Like you're a burden. Like, we yeah. love you, but man, Dan Soder's. A and then I'll be like, so I'm hoping the way I, just an aneurysm, <laughs> right? Just go, then it's pow. See you. I might later, not right? die. Been thinking about that forever, <laughs> never, never gonna die. I don't know if I'd be infused in with a computer. <laughs> I think mean, it's my new conspiracy. Death's not real. What do you oh, think wow. that's happened to the people who died? Who, who died? died? Who died? Dude? Dude, Name no. one. I don't know anybody. I'm so excited like, for this. <laughs> you to get on HGH and start wearing a trench coat, and no shirt under it. Death is merely an illusion. <laughs> what happened to Sean Taylor? He got fucking killed by a guy breaking into his house. Yeah. He was one of the greatest Did safeties he, of all time. He, he yeah. didn't die. I don't even know who that is. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, dude, that's one of those, like, those athletes that die like that. You're like, shit. But Doug Stanhope used to have an awesome bit about you don't want to see heroes live too long. Like, right. if Hendrix was, like, Cash 60, out early, yeah. just doing the Super Bowl halftime show with his yeah. gut hanging that's, out. That's the mm-hmm. problem watching rappers get old. You know, yeah. Biggie and Pac go, and it's like, oh, you put them on Forever the a legend. You watch rappers who are like, I'm fucking these hoes and dealing drugs and shit now. They're like grandpa. Like, oh, I can't wait for weird. old Takashi 69. <laughs> yeah. He's like, I don't think we're going to see that. Wow. <laughs> yeah. Dude, yeah. He's not making it. But what if he gets I think so like. He's made it this long. That I think yeah. did they just forgive him. I actually. Like, it, there's I, definitely been times think, where it's been easy enough to kill him. I think yeah. gang gang life took a hit. Like, I, everyone was like, as soon as Takashi 69's out, he's going to get murdered. He snitched on gangs. You just die. And he just did. He just, did, he like, just snitched as much as he saying New York and, gangs are weak? Uh, yeah. Apparently, come oh, at dude. me. Come at me, bro. Get over on this side. Yeah. yeah. Uh, <laughs> I say all, all your gangs rep your set. I would, yeah. I would be so mad if gangs killed me oh, and not Takashi 69. Like, what the fuck? It would be, about? honestly, I, I think it would be. shit other than make a joke on a podcast. It would be the. It, they would get away with it because the cops would be like, there's no way no, a couldn't be. gang couldn't be. Why killed would this, this white man <laughs> yeah. that has zero influence with gangs. This guy pushing his Hyundai down the street. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> yeah dude, I um, I don't know. They always say that. They always say like the mafia is still around and like gangs are still around, but Here's I don't want to find, I I mean, find I that out. Yeah, I think the Takashi's really question last that. week. Oh, uh, yeah. How many people do you think have been killed? This is such a dumb question now that I'm repeating it. <laughs> yeah. How many people do you think have been killed by being dropped into the ocean. Like, we forced you to walk the plank, or the mafia oh. puts like, the, the bricks on you and throws yeah. you into the water. Well, concrete. It's a lot. I don't think. Uh, well, okay, we so did I mean, all the research. Mean, what's a lot? Because this person, right. yeah, this person posited that it was 10 billion people. Okay. Well, that what? person's wrong. <laughs> yeah, yeah. There's only been like 100 billion people yeah, who have ever lived. True. So. What? Yeah. He thinks a 10 of people that have ever <laughs> Who's lived. Who's this person? Who's yeah. this idiot? He was a caller. <laughs> I was like, that was the stupidest answer we've ever had in the history of our show. Yeah, I mean, that's like, you just don't know he's a pirate? He's like, I'm telling <laughs> no. you, it's a lot more than I you kept, think. I kept notches below deck. You're, you're really <laughs> yeah. underselling it. But I a lot say, how damn people have walked. Uh, <laughs> it's a pretty depressing one, but the slave trade did have a lot of that. Yeah, so they would jump off. Are, those numbers are a lot higher than you we think. We did forget if, the if, slave trade. If slave traders slave were like trade. getting arrested or like at sea, like a ship was coming, they'd dump their cargo and they'd Damn. just dump everybody. Damn. Uh, shit like that. That happened I'd a like lot. to revise People my would get answer sick. from people earlier. People like, would get sick. They'd be like, out. Totally yeah, dude, you forget when the, we the old traveling route. wasn't we went, like... We went pirate route. We and, forgot. And, we, and then we Googled we that, and they the, said they didn't You guys really forgot about that. the slave trade? We forgot yeah. about the East India typical, trading. Typical <laughs> bar store. Look how much <laughs> Shane has grown, and you have <laughs> yeah. grown. At, you have not grown at all. Yes. And number I've two... Grown. And then and also... The headline now will be Shane Gillis talks about slaves. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, fuck. But, yeah, I think also people travel used to just be like that. They'd be like, the poor people, the coffin. Yeah. Get him out of here! Uh, and then yeah, like, like, Not me, sir. And just fucking push him into the ocean. Swim, swim. <laughs> so I would say over fifty million. Whoa! I think, history of I, the world, dude. I think, I think he's, even even I think with he's the close. slave trade, I don't think you're getting. It's well, a history major. Let's stop talking about. I think. Slaves. Well, hold on. <laughs> Are we talking? We're not talking shipwrecks. No, you got, you no, gotta be like, like a thrown. human into the water as they're dead. Like, like those Shit. people at the bottom of Titanic, the poor people on Titanic, they, 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 don't, they count. don't count. Yeah. What? Well, Ooh, what? That's well, I guess point. they kind of count. No, there's bodies, dude. You don't take away from my 50 million because well, no, you're economic, <laughs> socioeconomic, they matter or don't matter. It's fucking breathing humans. It, but like, they weren't dumb. It was just you heard it here. Feidelberg doesn't think uh, handicapped people are people. He was like, <laughs> those are halvesies. You get halves on those. Yeah. 
<laughs> yeah. Do you think to dump the handicapped people that use those things at like hotel pools? Yeah, we're like, <laughs> <laughs> they go, this is a very slow, cruel way for me to die. Yeah. They go, hold on. <laughs> we got to use it. We yeah. had to buy it. The I'm state sorry. made us buy it. Holiday Inn. <laughs> Holiday, yeah. Holiday Inn made us install it. Yeah. Why do they have this? <laughs> So you can so you can enter and make kids feel weird. Where you go? Get them in. Are they for fats? I think so. And if you're that fat that you need a chair to be lowered into the Holiday Inn Express, you better be a the head of a crime organization. How do you how do you get out? I think it's the same way. You're sitting there. Honestly, I think you're really making me going to bring my swim shorts to fucking Indianapolis. I love swimming in hotels. Gary. Let me in. It's <laughs> <laughs> the best. I'm doing I tried it. to use swimming the one in, in Tampa pools, this weekend. Swimming in pools is one of those. I was trying to use it, and it didn't work. That, a, a hotel pool is one of those, like, it, it's it's fun until the day you're dead. You're like, it's yeah. fun as a kid. And there's it, it, that's, That reek of chlorine, chlorine <laughs> yeah, 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 that yeah. whole vibe. It's, I'll tell you what sucks, <laughs> though, is because go I go on the road by myself. So then I try to hit the hotel pool, uh -huh. and then I walk down there. Take you know shirt off, walking outside, and then there's like three kids in the pool, and I just <laughs> yeah, you can't do that. You can't swim by you yourself. You can't do that. No, no, no. Dude, no. you can't also relax. You can't relax as a solo man in a pool it looks like that. Crazy. You go, oh. <laughs> well, that's what I do. Dude. I just lay out. There. Do you do? Do you do the hot tub? Like ever? float? Like oh, you just yeah. float yeah. around? I'll float. I'll get, yeah. I, I love usually, a back. I'm more float. of a down and back underwater type the, guy. The float. Yeah. Something like big into that. I like doing that. I'll tell you this. My favorite thing in the world: go down, blow the nose out. <laughs> Come up and wipe it off. You'll never breathe better. You blow your nose underwater, yeah. Soder? Yeah, because if not, you come up and there's bugs all over Christ your nose. Christ almighty. You guys didn't swim as a kid and come dude, up and I don't bugs know why. all over no, your nose? You were like a nose swim, holder? Seeing you swim would be so funny. I, just, I know you coming out of the water like, Duh. <laughs> Dude, I wanted to fuck this girl in college so bad, and I went to Arizona where there was like a lot of pools, and I came out of the water one time, and she's like, you're like Swamp Thing. And I was like, oh, <laughs> that's over. Oh. No, we're never fucking. It strings of water coming out my hands and my chin. I know you were. I was like, you were like what? <laughs> what? Oh, <laughs> what? Oh, it's God. totally. Get out of here. It's totally me going. <laughs> oh, <laughs> yeah. It's like ew, you're like swampy. You're like what? What? <laughs> 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 He might be legitimately puking. Why? Because you're swamping. Because you're disgusting. <laughs> Why do they make you walk? You're like swamping. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, you're falling You're apart, puking because I'm Swamp Thing? Yeah. It gets in your eyes. Do you open them underwater? I don't. <laughs> burning. I, bur I love to see underwater. Dude, I've. I love to see it underwater. I love to see it underwater. I always keep my eyes open. Dude, and I smoke a lot of weed, so it's always chlorine oh, it's eyes. It's so cool when you're underwater high. Dude, the best was when we did Bonnaroo. Uh, Big J and I did Bonnaroo together in 2015, and we all were at the hotel pool swimming. And my ex-girlfriend was, like, splashing around, and we were, like, having fun, and they were playing around. And I thought it, she tried to swim away, and I grabbed her ankles, and I pulled her back to me, so I waterboarded her. <laughs> and she came up, and I was like, <laughs> and I had to be like, oh, shit. I was, like, yeah. looking at Jane, trying not to so laugh. Fucking funny. And so I was like, oh, shit, oh, shit. And yeah. she was like, and I thought if she was going to laugh, we were all going to have yes, a great time. Yeah. And then she was like, that hurt, and I was like, "Oh, oh fuck. Fuck. Yeah. you can." You and can. she had to walk away, and I looked at Shane. I was like, oh. yeah. "You can, oh you can fucking bulldog women in a pool. Dude. Yeah. It's the only place you're allowed to physically dude, assault women. You can, you can just choke fucking. slam them, and they can grab your you arm, baptize them, dude. Oh, oh yeah, dude, hold them up. Finishing moves yeah. all day, <laughs> dude. Learn how to take a bump, ladies. You can just get in the pool. And don't get in the pool, dude. If you're a woman, you see me in the pool. <laughs> don't you come near dude, me. I, I don't care if you're you a stranger. Stay shallow end. <laughs> yeah, I'm a. I'm a I'm going to come up from under the water swamp thing and then rock bottom you. <laughs> Stand <laughs> standing, grabbing a lady and rock bottoming her. <laughs> be fun as hell. Oh, dude, we, He's uh, got a couple of kids on the side. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Woo! That's my buddy Shane right there. <laughs> I go, you want to see Swamp Thing take this lady out? Dude, we, so wait, when quarantine started, I was in Key West. Yeah, I, I remember like, that. There you're on your salt there. life. I was salt life for a couple weeks, and uh, 
there was it was spring break in Key West, mm-hmm. so my hotel was just hot babies. <laughs> <laughs> and Wait, in your pool? In the hotel and you pool. Still went to and the I pool. sat over the balcony and just oh. <laughs> drank Miller High oh, Some but, lady, some lady but, being like, "Who's that guy?" <laughs> hey, look yeah. up. I was in the corner hey. of the hotel. Hey. But Matt, Matt, I was I was talking to Matt McCusker, and he was like, "You should cannonball." <laughs> while the college girls are swimming and then get at one of those boards and just start waiting for <laughs> Rough pool, just rough waves! Your, just by yourself. <laughs> Dude, the thought of a solo man at spring break <laughs> coming, up under, <laughs> bu- coming up under their floats and pushing them off. <laughs> and then they're like, hey, what are you doing <laughs> Who is this guy? Ew. <laughs> 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 starting, starting a horrible. Chase, <laughs> oh, oh, you guys should do chicken fights. Yeah. Here, someone get on my back. <laughs> Ew, he's on me. <laughs> and the swamp thing out of nowhere yeah. pops up. Dude, just come up I'm and, here also. Dude, I would come up and grab her in my arms. <laughs> come out of the water and grab her abs. I'd be like, I'll take you to safety. I'm Swamp Thing. The Swamp Thing's so funny. <laughs> yeah, dude, that girl fucking stuck me with that. I got ear holed by that coming out of the water. Oh, fuck. <laughs> you haven't forgotten that, huh, though? That, no, that man, that one, because I thought I was in with her. Yeah. And she said that, and I was like, Never. I was wearing these green swim trunks, and I was like, Damn. That 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 girl, you know, you're you were known as Swamp Thing in that like crew that crew of girls. Yeah, it was the hottest. That was the hot. Yeah, that was the hottest group of girls yeah. that I knew yeah. in college. <laughs> Props to her for that's a good reference though. Yeah, I know. I know we wanted the fucker. I, I was like, oh god, and you get early '90s cartoon references. <laughs> right. They're amazing. I love you. Yeah, and it, yeah. <laughs> well, wait, there's a Swamp Thing show. Yeah. Really? There's, there's they've a whole, tried to do whole Swamp Thing. Franchise, yeah. Several. It's what? a whole thing. It's never, it's a mo- it's never really grabbed, but they tried it a bunch of different the ways. The 80s movie is the best because it's bad. Yeah, because yeah. he looks shitty. It's funny when I he I put looks like bad. Swamp Thing with also just the thing and the blob and yeah. all of those things from the 80s. Yeah, but it's more of a comic book than you realize. Yeah, right, it's nerd right, shit. Right. And I look like I'm coming out of a <laughs> fucking pool at an apartment <laughs> complex in Arizona. <laughs> Dude, my, hey. oh, what's up, dude? My favorite, sunscreen? my favorite moment of, of can you get my back of yeah. bumming out hot babies is yeah. when I had two friends move from Colorado when I was still living in Tucson. They were done with college. Nothing, nothing better than making the hot babies sad, sad dude. <laughs> or mad, dude. My buddy, my, my my buddy wanted a party with hot babies so bad he got arrested. That happens, that happens to a lot of guys. So I, <laughs> my two friends came down to Tucson. The, I was, you know, two of my best friends from Colorado, and they're like, "Hey, we're done with school. We want to change the pace. We want to get out of Colorado. We'll live with you in Tucson." I was saving up money to move here to do stand up. So they're like, "Dude, we got six months. Let's get an apartment." And I was working, and so I was like, "You guys got to find the apartment. I have, I have my apartment now." They found one in like a college apartment complex, <laughs> and we were all out of school, and it was like the fall. Dude, that sounds like a plot of like a TV show or a movie right? or something. It was like the fall of the next school year, and I was like, eh, "I don't go to school here anymore." And they were having like a lot of college parties, and one night there was these girls and this guy in the hot tub, and they, we were on our balcony, and we were like. Uh, we're drunk, and we're like, what are you guys doing? <laughs> Just being an idiot. Up. And this guy knew me. This guy knew me that I went to Arizona. He's like, is it soda? And I was like, what? <laughs> no. He's like, come down here. Different we, guy. So we went down there. Me and my buddy uh, went down there, and he was like, I shouldn't have used his last name. But, uh, <laughs> shout out, Jack. Shout up? out. But we go down there, and uh, we're all hammered. And these two girls are naked with this guy, and they're like, you can come in the hot tub, you have to yeah, get naked. Yeah, we definitely shouldn't use his last name. <laughs> yeah, you guys can cut this. You can bleep that out. Uh, oh, who cares? He, this, he you know, cool he's got a perfect... Hell. Yeah, well, it's not cool where it goes. Right. Uh, <laughs> so these girls are like, we, we like sit with them for a little bit, and then they leave, and I'm... Because I knew the guy, and I'm like, oh, this is... You guys don't want to party. Whatever, I'm I gotta get out of here. Yeah. No, you lingered. That was on purpose. I lingered on purpose. Yeah, and yeah, then yeah. I knew I they didn't want me. So I bailed. When it, I, I, wa- I wanted to wait for the ratio to be two to two and be yeah. like, did you, dunk, <laughs> did you dunk your head in the hot tub? Did I you got go under and pop up. So the next night we're out drinking and we all come back to our uh, apartment. And, you know, my buddy's like, let's go to the hot tub, thinking that's just a thing that's going to be there every night. And it's not. We're with a friend. <laughs> My friend Alexis, and she's like, I'll go with you guys. And then he was like, let's skinny dip. They were skinny. So they get naked, and I'm like, I'm not getting naked. This is hilarious to watch you guys swim. A security guard walks around. He's like, hey, put your clothes back on. And they're like, fine. Guy calls the cops because they stayed naked. Cops show up. My buddy's in the pool, and you can just see his ass (laughs) because of the pool lights. And the cop's like... 
put on your swim trunks. And he's just hammered. And he's like, I didn't do anything. <laughs> <laughs> and the cop's like, put on your swim trunks. And he swims over to his swim trunks and like pulls them in the water. Like the cop can't see what's going on under the water. And he puts them on. And he's like, I didn't do anything. <laughs> and the second he gets out, the cop grabs him. He tries to move. Cop fucking slams oh, him. Oh, nice. Arrests him. Takes him to jail. He said, put your clothes on because I'm about to whoop your ass. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I want to yeah. get your dick on. I, I, I thought that, that was like, put your clothes on, I'll let you out. Dude, and that's what I thought. Slide. And yeah. then he grabbed his wrist and then he was oh, drunk yeah. and he did like the, no. And then he was like, <laughs> see you later. Wrapped that around cop the was like, yes. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I've been waiting for this. Yeah. Full on yeah. fucking uh, German suplex them yeah. right <laughs> on the. This is the whole reason I joined the force. Yeah. Suplexes college. Just trust me, you douchebag. Tucson police love to wrestle anyone that's not on meth. So they were like, this will be light work. Yeah. This will be easy. And dude, he got arrested and just picking him up the next day, we were like, what did you think was going to happen? And he was like, I don't know. Yeah. I don't fucking know. It's great, though. The second he was like, I didn't do anything wrong, the cop was like, I'm going to fuck this kid up. Yeah. Also, he was, he was swimming away from him as he was saying yeah. it. He was, I didn't do anything. And then he swam to a part where the cop had to walk around to the other side of the pool, and he's like, get out. And he's like, I didn't do anything. <laughs> were, you, were you standing there like a, like a pussy friend that was like... Stop! Yeah. Listen to him. I, I was smoking cigarettes. Do what he just, says. Oh, no, I was just smoking cigarettes, being like. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> and Alexis, do. Alexis Listen was going him. like, he doesn't have it. He's not. He didn't do uh, anything. Uh, no. and then it just. And then we picked him up from jail the next day with a one-legged man. <laughs> sure. Yeah, I swear to God, we just sure. show up to Tucson jail, and he's like, "Hey, can you give my buddy a ride home that I met in jail?" And he's got one leg. He's got a prosthetic <laughs> yeah. leg. And he sits my, behind my buddy Chad, who's in the who's sitting shotgun, right? And we're driving back, and he the guy lived by us, so we're giving him a ride. Alexis what was is he driving. For? That's what we asked him. Piracy, yeah. dude. That's what we yeah. <laughs> making people walk the plane. Yeah. Dude, we're in the car. This is one of my favorite moments that my friend Chad didn't realize he was an asshole because we're driving back to the apartment, and we're like, yeah. So we're telling this guy about how he wouldn't get dressed, and that's why he got arrested. And the guy's like, man, that's crazy. It's just black dude with a prosthetic leg, and he's like. That's why you're in jail? Because you wouldn't put on your swim trunks? <laughs> <laughs> and he's sitting behind Chad, and he's like, yeah, you know, me and my girl got into a fight in the parking lot. We started screaming at each other. She ran, and, you know, I can't run. <laughs> and my friend Chad doesn't realize this guy's got one leg. I don't know if he didn't see it yeah, get in the yeah. car. So it's from the front seat. He goes, you don't know how to run? <laughs> like that. And then and we drop him off in the apartment, and the guy gets out, and Chad just goes, you guys didn't tell me in one way. <laughs> and we're like, yeah, well, uh, now you That's fucking know. What the, and you got to be staggeringly unaware to not realize that someone has one fucking leg. We were all so leg. hungover. We, yeah. we were like drinking till four and then picked them up at like 8 a.m. Yeah. when we could. But it was, <laughs> dude. You didn't tell me that. <laughs> dude, it was so great. You don't know how to run? Oh, it's the worst. And the guy just was like, oh, fuck it. I'm going to get my ride home. Dude, that's, <laughs> there's nothing worse than when you don't know someone's got a disability. Like, it happens uh, during shows yeah. constantly. Yeah. Like, you'll be doing, I was doing stand up, I was doing an all black show in Philly. Yeah. Like black as hell. And uh, <laughs> this one, there was, there was like one white dude there. I, I did notice him, but I didn't notice anything about him. Yeah. And I got on stage, and the, the he was kind of to my right, like behind me. And he just was like, <laughs> <laughs> he just started sneezing nonstop, and I was like, "Yo, could you shut the fuck up?" <laughs> I looked over, and he was he was mentally handicapped. Was like, I'm so sorry. I was like, "No, dude, dude I'm sorry." And the whole crowd was just like, Ooh, "What about when?" You and I was like, "I didn't know he was fucked up." And then I was like, "Ah, oh, my bad again." Yeah. What about the Magoobies table? The Magoobies. <laughs> Is you called insane. me after the show. It is so I was at Magoobies in Baltimore. I'm going to be there at the end of this month. Yeah, and uh, go get tickets. There was a there was a guy there was a table of mentally challenged dudes. It was like a day uh, out. That's big day out. That's my demo. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. They flew, love them. One flew over the cuckoo's nest, got tickets, <laughs> and then <laughs> this I couldn't see because when you're up there, there's spotlights, so yeah. you can't really see. So I saw a shadow of a dude holding on to a woman's shirt, getting led out to go to the bathroom, oh, no. and I was like, "Yo, you guys see how fucked up that guy was?" <laughs> and everyone was quiet, and I was like. All right, why? Well, who cares? The guy's <laughs> fucked up. And I kept saying fucked up instead of drunk, which would have helped. Yeah. Because yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. you're giving old terminology. He goes, Did you guys see that water brain walking <laughs> yeah. to the bathroom? And, and then like, when I saw him come what? back in, I could kind of see their face this time. And I was just like, oh, oh shit, no. this guy is <laughs> very mentally challenged. Oh, no. And I literally was like, I mean, in front of everyone, I was like, you see this fucked up guy? Oh, <laughs> and everyone was like, no, dude. Dude, I, I was doing, back when I was doing check spots at Stand Up New York, it was like, Stand Up New York is probably the second most popular club, so it was packed all the time. 
And check spots are when you're an open micer, you go up when they drop the checks and you just eat. You just right. eat it. You just, just bomb. bomb. So you <laughs> learn how to not bomb. That's like the good thing. But you bomb a lot. And I was on stage and I was fucking bombing. And this guy was just standing there like this. And I was like, ah, this guy, I'm bombing so bad, this guy fucking won't even look at me. And the guy got <laughs> no. the blind head. And no. I was like, ah. Yeah. <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. That they have that, like, you know, yeah. Oh, that what? bobblehead happens. Yeah. And I was like, and then I saw his, no, no, no. I thought I saw his smoky eyes. <laughs> I was like, you know, and he was like, no, I'm not. And I was like, oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, fuck. <laughs> oh. And, then just, and then it w went worse. I got it. I got it with Oh, sorry. <laughs> it was, we, ours wasn't us recognizing one. It was when we had arrested one time when I was a kid. Yeah. yeah. And we were, it was like, me and my buddy got arrested, and we got put in the back of a car. We're already sitting in the back of the car. And we had our buddy with us who had one arm. And there's like a silence. It's late at night. We're getting pulled over for being underage drinking and stuff like that. And you just hear this woman who had been being a bitch to us for a while. Like, she was. She was being a cop arrested. Oh, so it was a female officer guy? Yeah. All right. And, and she just goes, what the fuck is this? And we're like, oh, shit. What did Adam have in his pocket? Like, that is not going to be good. And you just hear him kind of, like, slur out because he's a little drunk. He goes, uh, an arm? And, and she goes, we, we start, like, laughing in the back oh, seat. Oh, no. Like, oh, somebody's arm. And then she just doubles down. I thought she was going to get apologetic. And she goes, what the fuck do I do with it? <laughs> oh, goes, my Jesus. God. And he goes, I guess you just treat it like the other ones, and oh, we start my God. losing. Like we're rocking in the backseat of the cop car. Like it looks like like two people in a cartoon are having sex. Like, was he like, <laughs> bouncing, and we are screaming. Wait, laughing. was he when he was arrested? Did she put the cuffs on the fucking fake arm? Yeah, that's he was like. I, I don't. I, I figured they taught that's, you in school how to do yeah. this. Dude, like, that's the way know. to do it. Where you just go. You want to see something cool? Yeah. Pop <laughs> <laughs> out of that. You have a key in your mouth. Yeah. You go. <laughs> <laughs> you go, what you don't know is this. <laughs> I don't even need the key. Then you start hitting her with the arm. You're like, oh, fuck. Dude, that is... Yeah, true. Yeah, there's... Uh, having a prosthetic limb has to be moments where you can really fuck with people in a fun way. Like that. Oh, he popped it off as soon as he got in the car. Yeah. Just like, yeah, oh, never mind. I'm out. Look at this. <laughs> does that feel good? Does that feel... That furious. That's a question for someone like that. Does that feel good on his nub when he lets off the arm? Does it like... Oh, I'm it's sure like, that's like... It's like when girls take off bras yeah. and they're like... That you know, he's like, Ooh, get your yeah. pants off and you I get would, out I would guess work. definitely. Yeah. yeah, probably rub that nub. <laughs> rub that nub, dude. Shane's <laughs> got a very inquisitive face. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. no, I'm just getting mad about a Coors Light commercial. Why? Where a hot chick come home, comes home and takes her bra off and starts drinking a Coors Light. <laughs> yeah, what a, what a lady, like, dude. This yeah. is not real. Yeah. <laughs> if you're a fucking lady getting home from work, popping a bra off and drinking a Coors. You're not, yeah, you're, you're not hitting you're the blue mountains. I bet you. I bet you the courts have taken your kids. Oh, hundred percent. If you're popping your fucking, you know, your tits out and slamming a fucking <laughs> silver bullet, the sun's out. In yeah, commercial. She just pops it with one hand. She goes. <laughs> she goes. This should stop my shakes. <laughs> they're gonna make it really alcoholic. Yeah, dude. Drink responsibly. I'm just a girl who's home from work. I'm just a hot ass chick drinking cores with my. Gotta tits let my out. tits breathe. I had a long day. Yeah. of being a CEO. Yo. Sorry, I was, I was running the world, and now I need to suckle on this cool Colorado water. Yeah, dude, dude, they dude. should have her shown with like a thirty stone. She should have been like thirty Keystone lights. She should have been, he she should have been hellish. Yeah, heavy, she should have heavy been lady, just, a ghoul, just, a ghoul, an absolute ghoul. Yeah, when she gets when she gets done at the breakfast shift at the bowling alley. <laughs> That's when you take your bra off. <laughs> yeah. before, before she takes that bra off, she just lets out like a big fart. Yeah. Oh. She's been holding it in her yeah. over. She's like, oh. <laughs> Dude, and I want to watch her take her bra off, then put on a cat sweater, <laughs> then drink a Bud Light, and just be like, this whole world <laughs> fucked <laughs> up. <laughs> <laughs> All 20 cats come. Yum, 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 yum. Find Tibble to home. Tibble will be all right. Dude, I don't think Tibble will be okay. If he's not okay, that's okay. <laughs> what do you mean? He's like, I love him. God bless his soul. I love him. But he's a cat, you know? He's a cat. cat you gotta let him the, out. The most disposable. They're disposable. <laughs> you can, I mean, obviously, in our. I'm from kill, a long line. What is, dude the, mo what is the most disposable animal? You think it's a cat? Uh, well, I was, I was doing what everybody that talks about cats does is comparing it to dogs. 
Yeah. It's always they're yeah, like, yeah, I, it's yeah. like I like cats. Like really, I like dogs. Yeah. It's like, well, I, I like dogs too, dude. I'm telling you, I like cats. <laughs> I like cats. All right, you yeah, wrong with dogs, that. asshole. <laughs> yeah. You know, yeah, but cat people oftentimes always try to put them over dogs. That's where they lose a lot of people because that is, like, I mean, that's just you. crazy. You know, it's just not. They're like, really no, no, no. But this cat is, is different. like a dog. Yeah, you're right. Best, all right. The best compliment you can give a cat is it's you're like a dog. Yeah, they're just best compliment you can give a dog is meat. Just give it meat. <laughs> like, that's for you. My grandpa killed. Uh, so my whole f- my dad grew up on a creek, and he yeah. had a bunch of brothers and sisters. And they grew up on like a farm type compound thing, and they had cats everywhere. Every year they would just get overrun with fucking from cats. what? <laughs> just a bunch of cats. Once you have a couple, they breed. Dude, yeah, <laughs> break out of his crazy house. Stop. I used to live the, the place I lived in the Bronx would just get overrun with yeah. stray what? cats just forever. Cat scratch <laughs> fever. Oh yeah, dude. They and would then just one multiply. day my uh, grandpa bundled a bunch of them up. Kittens in a sack and threw them in the creek in front of the kids. <laughs> dude, in front of the kids? Yeah. This was, I, I remember this. Th- 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 those Damn, dude, your grandpa like, made a I, clan I, of warriors. It, broke, it broke on the dam, the sack. It hit the dam, oh, no. and a couple of kittens got came out. back. Oh, and dude, like, you got to adopt stay. those. He said they can stay. Oh, those are survivors. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. What a I, test. I what a Hercules a, test. I, I knew a guy. Yeah, a, a, a feat of strength. Oh, oh, you can survive so grandpa throwing you in the creek. <laughs> yeah, yeah dude, watching stay. all those fucking little... <laughs> oh, so sad, paws dude. Kittens push. are so cute. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, kittens. Ki- uh, I don't like cats. I like kittens. Yeah, kittens So once great. they grow of age, you should throw them in the river. I like milf I, kittens. <laughs> you know, I like mommy cats. You like natural. I like legal. big, fat, nippled cats. I knew a family who had a like a problem cat. I think they had a baby, and the cat was like pawing or whatever. They're like, we got to get rid of this cat. And they like they called like, it was like I don't know the 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 the, the dad's brother or the somebody who some they guy. know is willing to kill it. <laughs> yeah. yeah. right. yeah, yeah. everyone everyone needs one of those guys in your phone. Cat killer. It's like yeah, I'll be right over. Ah, yeah. uh, hold on, <laughs> dude. He took a cat, took the cat, went out on his boat, tied it to a brick, fucking threw what? it in the river. <laughs> what? Come on, dude. That's so oh, much shoot like it. Difficult. Yeah, yeah. shoot yeah. it. Don't I make guess you don't have a gun. Whatever, buddy. dude. I would rather smash it in a bag with a hammer than just <laughs> toss it. Yeah, put it in a bag and swing it against. Yeah, the wall. do no. it, dude. I want instant death. I'd rather death. throw a cat in the water with a brick. No, and smash no you put it. What are you gonna teach other the... cats not to snitch? <laughs> yeah, you gotta also, fucking. Also, why you want to smash it? Yeah, dude. Why does it need to be on a brick? Like. You, you probably just go out. Yeah, just throw like the cat's well, not but, coming but, but, but home. Then, but then it really struggles and man, what's the, this is a quick drowning. All right, here's a good question. <laughs> what hurts your conscience the least way to kill? What's the, what to kill a cat? What's the easiest way to kill a cat? A shovel. Just one shot. Yeah. I think. Uh, yeah, um, I think a shovel's like a, a good answer. I'll tell you. I'll person. throwing it off a cliff might be easy. Yo, yeah, that's great. <laughs> but you can hear that. <laughs> it would spread it. <laughs> you get a good laugh. You can hear that yell the whole time. <laughs> a, a fucking get one dink with a shovel. Oh man, yeah. I don't know. I, what about like smothering it, like an old like an Gun. old a shovel a might actually be tough. It yeah, because if you don't you hit like it, hit its back and it's just. It's like, all, you, uh, you, uh, you do it, you. Be- oh my god, I think if a you fucking just smash yeah. a cat's like spinal cord and oh. it doesn't oh. die. Oh. God, that'd be that's so tough. sad. I mean, it's all of it's really sad. <laughs> yeah. I think a, 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 a gun's harder to swing. I'd rather hit it with a bat. My cat Deuce McAllister. Yeah. Passed away. Oh, all right. Right. Great he running back, great cat. He got, got fucked up by something. He came back with his eye hanging oh, out. Oh, <laughs> my God. He, walked, he, like, limped back to the house. See, that's the thing. Everything we're, sa- everything yeah. we're saying put around... after that? Yeah, they put yeah, it Yeah, you got it. Yeah. Everything he was, like, we're... yellow with No, but jaundice. I mean, like, did you, did you, <laughs> did you, did you go to, like, a vet, or did somebody throw it in the river? I think my dad <laughs> took it to the vet and okay. put it down, I think. But then he buried it. If I know anything about your dad, I don't think he brought it to the vet. I don't think Mr. Gillis employed a lot of men. He's just on his phone, and he goes, I'm looking by for a crick. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah, now you guys mentioned it, I definitely was lied to. <laughs> My favorite though is he th- he took our black lab to put it down. And then he tried to bury it in the backyard, but we had a, it was a huge dog, so it took him like <laughs> four hours to yeah. dig this hole. And there was just a dead dog in the back of his car. Oh, and it, had, like, oh it had like God. stiffened. Oh no. <laughs> he had to carry it. Oh no. Did you go look at it? <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> No, he had to carry like a fully stiffened <laughs> with black it, with lab. the paws coming out of the yeah. sheet. Yeah, it looked oh like uh, my God. looked like in something about Mary. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> he's got the cast. Dude, that is digging your pet's grave. That's that's some dad shit too. It's the best like, way to God get over. Damn it, I got because while you're digging, you're just like, you know what? Fuck yeah. this. Fucking dig and cry. Dude. Yeah, by the end of it, you're just like, tired. You hate it. Yeah. Yeah. I was gonna I'm say done. you start by crying, and yeah. by the end, you're like, it's fucking hot. Happy this thing's fucking tired. Fucking sweaty. I'm gonna go to sleep. 
I'm, I'm tired. Asleep. I'm asleep. I'm asleep in this grave, dude. I feel. I feel like we've got a, a lot of good material for your next skits here. Perfect. <laughs> I think a lot yeah. of sketches came out of this. True. Killing cats. A lot of cat with, murder. With... I don't know if John will like that, <laughs> no. but I do. I actually do think that'd be funny. <laughs> Yo, you, you guys are on fucking fire. Thank you very much. It's so goddamn good. It's so it's so goddamn good. Good. fucking oh, thanks, funny. Guys. And I I really would have bet. That a Trump sketch right now would have been like, oh, we're still doing this, but yeah. that was fucking. Yo, man. Da- Trump speed dating people did is Trump fucking funny. Trump they never did it. Kind of wrong. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> they always a lot made of funnier ways to do it. Over the top of what he is instead of just what he what is. What he is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Which is the funniest thing. And you know what I think is really, <laughs> the, the funniest thing about that skit wasn't even like the, the sex stuff. When you were just like, social media, I was so good at it, they wouldn't let me do it. Like, just little <laughs> Thanks, things like man. that were the yeah. funniest thing. It's and about fucking it. Kyla coming in at the end. Kyla Fox. Unbelievable. Kyla's wild, dude. Kyla's uh, so many sketches so far. She is just un- uh, Uncle Daycare, oh, <laughs> Trump yeah. sketch. She's, yeah, I mean, dude, I, I just think what else she's in. Uncle yeah, Uncle Daycare, so dude, so her as a lady funny. uncle. I was po- I mean, you possibly. Yeah. He'll it, show me cuts of the sketches, and I'm like, I was at his house, and he showed me a cut of Uncle Daycare, and I fucking lost it at the Foley line. Yeah. Foley's Foley, Foley's H Foley, fucking... him sitting down for speed dating it was great. You should. Like. We'll probably put out the outtakes of that because any any time Foley. He's on. He just has lines. <laughs> like we're like, all right, because none of it's really written. Mm-hmm. It's all just kind of like, all right, get Framework. to this, get to this. Yeah. And then Foley will sit down and just ramble for like a minute <laughs> of just the craziest <laughs> shit. You just gotta sit there like, yeah. yeah. Like, you know? uh, and Chris Wood, I mean, out of his mind, dude. I mean, he's the great. football sketch, the cut you guys did, where he says he's looking oh, for clues. Looking, <laughs> we're gonna be out there looking for clues. <laughs> yeah, it's dude, it's, it's what's your it favorite was, one so far? Uh, I like the coach sketch. Yeah. Football coach? Yeah, that's yeah, really yeah. Funny. yeah, man. What's great is watching, dude, John McKeever's one of the funniest human beings on the yeah, planet. Yeah. So to finally get, it, you know, like people need to watch his shit. Go watch his old stand up. He's fucking yeah. hilarious. Yeah. He stopped doing stand up, which is insane. Which is always so good. Those are always the guys that are the best. Yeah. Really? Yeah, man. My friend Joe stop? Alexander stopped doing it, and he was way better than me. And you're like, really? What are you doing? Yeah. What are you? Do-? But what, they're, they're, just, they're just over the lifestyle. They're over the fucking. They don't know. Shit happens. Other stuff. And also, happens. there is a period where it does suck. I like a I long think the, period. Yeah, the whole time until yeah. you yeah. make it. There's like ten. I mean, years I think you guys are crazy. Like, yeah, it sucks a lot. And so when you see people quit that are really good, it's a bummer because you're like, yeah. damn. Because then you see people who suck, who and keep who going. Keep going. Just and they start it's making all that man. money they make. You're like, I know a guy that should have that yeah, money. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But McKeever stopped definitely. He just likes directing and acting. Yeah. And he's unbelievable. He's the way those director. are shot, those sketches, man. The, it's hard when a friend makes a sketch and the lighting sucks and the sound yeah. is off and it's directed terribly. And then you got to be like, it's all right. great, I always do like a, I see what you're going for. You so these are awesome. Dude, just the reluctant share. Oh. <laughs> yeah. oh, is there anything oh. worse when your friend puts out something shitty? And you oh, be like, he shared like, a bunch of my stuff. Yeah. Yeah. Share. The but, Sleep Cop uh, looked like, I told you this last time on the unreleased tapes, Sleep Cop looked like a fucking TV show. Yeah. I mean, like the way that was. I'm yeah. telling you, man, McKeever's <laughs> fucking unbelievable. Yeah, yeah. Book Light, that's our production company. Yeah, Book Light does a great job. Yeah, man. Sleep with, and then the, um, the fucking militia. With the yeah, gang. Yeah, that was fun. I, I think the militia with the gang might be my favorite one. Uh, yeah, know, that was a fun one. It's fun watching uh, Reggie Conquest uh, blow up in a lot because he's also, you yeah, know, he's, he's like, Chase he's thing. in Che, that yeah, damn yeah, Michael yeah. Che show. He's in Gillian right. Keeves. He's funny as fuck, too. Is there, yeah. uh, uh, is this like a revenue thing at some point? Or is I don't it just, know. We'll yeah, see. We'll like see what happens. Just, good shit, just right? keep putting stuff yeah. out and see. Yeah, you're like Chance the Rapper. You just keep putting out mixtapes with no record deal. See what happens. I think it's good, so I'll keep making it. But, you know, it's also like if, if you know that group of guys, they had this unbelievable pilot at Comedy Central called Delco Proper. Yeah. And it was like, oh, wow. you watch it. Tommy it's, and say no more with the Tommy, title. Is. Yeah. Like, oh, <laughs> all right, it's good. It's, oh, it's great. But it's McKeever, yeah. Tommy Pope, and so, mm-hmm. it's all the guys. He, right. That's how John is with acting, too. Yeah. Like he was with stand up. He's probably the best in our group of friends at acting. When he came in and played your. And he doesn't like doing it. Your partner in the cop, Sleeping Cop yeah. sketch. He kills it. He's so good. <laughs> kills it. Yeah. Yeah. What happened to that is the pilot just didn't get picked up? Because now I just it think It got picked these... up by Comedy Central, oh, and then they didn't, didn't do anything with put it. it on it. Yeah, they, I think they killed it. I don't know. Because nowadays, it just feels like you can do these things. Well, that's There's the certain thing. certain things are yeah, such yeah, a big sure. scale. You do need, like, a studio or whatever. For sure. But a lot of stuff, it's like, just go do Delco proper. Like, fuck it. Yeah, man, you can make yourself, shit. You know? The technology's all there. Yeah. You can make it yourself. And, Crazy. You know, these guys are proof of that. It's fun to watch. It's fucking great to watch. People I, make... I, I feel like it's got to be... I mean, it's pretty much like universally agreed upon right now. Everybody who's sharing it is like, these sketches are the best thing on the internet right now. That's fucking awesome. Yeah, it feels good. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. You know what I was think nice, some pretty funny people share it. What's nice about the Trump thing was like, I can do impressions. 
Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. And everybody, like, as soon as, you know, when I got fired, fired from Saturday Night Live, uh, <laughs> everybody was like, ah, he wouldn't have lasted. Like, he's he's never oh, well, that, acted, that, all the that. fact that you're doing like, sketches. Here it is. Is well, that's, good. I could do something. Well, you know what's yeah, funny is that's yeah. like, um, I feel like maybe that's why I feel I like Lauren Moneyball. Yeah, maybe <laughs> you know he got drafted, he washed out, and then started working hard to build it back up. Found he, a way to because he loves the game and stuff. I don't know. <laughs> Found a way to <laughs> rebuild the structure. But I feel like showing that you know you show that Trump sketch and as someone that was let go of a show like SNL does a lot of Trump shit. Lauren must have saw that and been like, "Yeah, like, oh, oh, cool. No, I'm, I'm not mad that you do an awesome Trump." Anybody there who actually still has a sense of humor left, seeing, you know, the last five, six weeks in a row of sketches, must be like, "Fuck." We do sketch comedy. The guy we fired for bullshit reasons is doing the best sketches on the planet Earth right now. Nice, thanks, man. (laughs) Yeah. No, I mean, I'm not doing it out of spite. That's got to be no, not so at all. There's good. no part of me that's yeah. uh, spiteful at all. But it's also this is this is what happens when you get to do shit with the people you want to make stuff with. You know, when you're making it with your friends, and there isn't that like corporate right. interest to be like, man, we're gonna need you to not say her pussy stinks, right? As right. Donald Trump, right. you're like, no, let it fly, Cheers let it girls. fucking fly, dude. Yeah. And I think we're in, I think we're at that phase now, in, in like all pop culture. Where it's like you can see where the networks are, and they're like, mm, people don't want to hear this, but then they're like, well, let's yes, go to the they internet, fucking and get do. what the fuck yeah. I want. Yes, they do. Yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah I remember uh, Ryan Long was saying that like people were like, oh, yeah, you're so brave with your sketches, and he's like, I'm, I've been doing this kind of material yeah. in front of people on the road and stuff. Oh and yeah, they're, you they're see it. cackling, laughing. So yeah. it's not a risk. I know that Dude, the masses it's will not like a risk it. At yeah. All. Yeah, what six at people all. loudly say on the internet right. doesn't mean that's what everyone right. fucking right. feels. Yep. For sure. And yep. you see that. You see it with comedy all the time. People are like, that's inappropriate. And it's also like all the comics that we love now, that like Richard Pryor's and shit, there yeah. was a whole group that were like, he shouldn't be fucking saying that. Fuck that. Don't of let course. him say that. Right. And then that all washes away. And you're like, oh shit, this guy's fucking one of the hilarious. greatest of all time. Yeah. You know? You guys both back on the road now? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Is it? Is it? I uh, didn't stop. Yeah, he never <laughs> stopped. <laughs> I got, I got I pulled stop. off for a little bit, yeah, but I'm back yeah. now. And and is billion, billions we are we, yeah we finished season five that's why I'm back on the road right okay because they were heavy on yeah, the COVID yeah, protocol couldn't get COVID uh, I couldn't I get, could I, see, I, I see. got it I just couldn't go get a new version yeah <laughs> they didn't want me to re up <laughs> fucking dude on the fucking Yankees got the Johnson and Johnson shot and then just got COVID really, really? just didn't work. Damn. Yeah. Johnson & Johnson is just fucking fake. Johnson & Johnson was like, was like oh, yeah. oh, this episode's we... pulled. Oh, oh, oh. oh, oh. We did it. Yeah, here we go. <laughs> it was like... a slanderous episode with a bunch of cat murder. <laughs> they they sexually harassed the producer at one point, saying Tiger Woods was... They said Tiger Woods! I forgot you did that. I said Tiger Woods. Ma'am, I'm sorry. I'm I sorry. said Tiger Woods. I'm sorry I brought this monster. I said Tiger Woods. I'll bring this whole company down. <laughs> no one's wearing a mask. <laughs> I'll fucking rip this whole goddamn thing down. <laughs> All right, let's go to answer the internet. Awesome, dude. That's right. <laughs> Listen, if you made it this far into the video... Which is far. Like, no one ever does that on the internet. Like, it's the end. You made it to the end the of the video. The full fucking video you, you watched did. the whole thing. So if you liked it and you watched the whole thing, why don't you subscribe? It means you like us. Click the subscribe button, because if you don't, I'm going to fucking murder John. And I'm going to like it. Kill him with my bare fucking hands. Yeah. And if you weren't sold on this video, there's plenty more. Watch what's next up, and then subscribe. But just subscribe, so I don't have to fucking kill him. Subs- well, I don't know. Do what you want, but subscribe. Probably. <laughs>